Well, new tonight, more confusion and frustration after a viral video shows Nevada's governor out to dinner surrounded by live entertainment. And before going to breaking news, Austin Carter spoke with a local tavern owner who says that he feels slighted by the incident. This video sparking continued conversations about the rules surrounding live entertainment in Nevada amid the coronavirus pandemic, the state's own governor at the center of it. Struggling taverns like Saddle and Spur Saloon in the Northwest, not happy with what they saw. Owner Bobby Kingston says they were served a cease and desist just this past week over having live music. You know, how can a governor that's created a mandate like this be physically in a business that's doing something within a few days after an agency acting on behalf of interpreting his mandates came in and stopped my business from doing it. When pressed about the live music incident this week at Monzu, Governor Sisolak fired back at folks who said he was violating his own mandates. They did extra cleaning in the restaurant. Ambient music, as it's called, where people do not go buy a ticket to go to that, where people do not pay an admission, where that's not the purpose of the visit, is allowed in a restaurant. The owner of Monzu also coming to the governor's defense, questioning the motives of those who posted the video. It really is sad to me that a situation that was pretty standard and normal has turned into something that is controversial when there's no controversy. Kingston says they've been forced to roll with the punches, making changes to capacity, enforcing social distancing and scaling down operations. The music and dancing scene also being tweaked. We've been doing a much scaled down version of the live shows that we used to have to make it more ambient, a little more background orientated, and a little more of a, a dinner music atmosphere. And while already battling a drop in revenue, Kingston says taverns are owed a clear explanation of what the rules are so they can continue to stop the spread while still turning a profit. This reckless kind of behavior that's projected on bars and taverns in Nevada just is, um, it, it, there's no basis to it. I'm Austin Carter, 13 Action News. And also in response to that video, the governor says that he's proud to support small businesses that are going above and beyond to continue to provide services during these unprecedented times, while also taking appropriate measures to help slow the spread of COVID-19.